Hello and welcome back. I hope you're all doing well. And today I'm thrilled to bring you a report from the Duchess of Sussex. So I know so many have been looking forward to hearing from her. And she has penned something so great. So I cannot wait to share this with you. As we know, the Duchess of Sussex is a patron of Mayhew, and that is her chosen patronage to reflect the causes and issues which she has spent decades championing, including animal welfare. So Mayhew today has published their annual review and report for 2020, and the Duchess of Sussex as well has provided a foreword for their review. So these are the highlights of what the Duchess of Sussex wrote, and it goes like this. Over the last year, people have felt the profound effects of the global pandemic, be it the health challenges far too many faced or the disproportionate life changes people have experienced. It has been an overwhelming process of grief, growth, and also of gratitude. I've heard from so many of you about the impact of having a pet with you at home during the isolation of lockdown. You have mentioned the therapeutic effect of having your animal by your side and the solace and comfort you found in their company. The effect is something Mayhew strives to deliver day in and day out to people throughout the UK and beyond. I want to thank every animal lover across London, the UK and the world who has supported Mayhew during the past year. Your help has meant that despite the hardship, Mayhew has been able to continue providing vital care to cats and dogs and the communities around them. I have been proud to witness Mayhew adapting to the moment through virtual rehoming, therapause visits over Zoom, and delivering care packages to animals and pet owners in need. The organization has rescued and rehabilitated cats and dogs in critical situations and, of course, delivered vital animal health services overseas in countries also gripped by the pandemic. When I reflect on 2020, I always come back to the importance of community and connection. We may have been forced apart, she wrote, but we found new ways to be close and support each other through this shared crisis. For many of us, this was made all the easier with our pets by our side. Mayhew and thousands of small community organizations like them will continue to listen, adapt their services, and provide the resources that people and pets need to stay together and persevere through hardships. She went on to say, as we collectively build to the future, my sincere hope is that we do so with ongoing support and appreciation for organizations like Mayhew, who continue their vital work in days of crisis and in days of calm. Their commitment to the cause of animal welfare is steadfast, and their effect on our community well-being is self-evident. So there we have it from the Duchess of Sussex, well put, and as the website points out that Megan herself has previously supported various rescue centers in Los Angeles. We all know about her rescue pups. So this is well in line with her own, you know, her own ethos and what she's all about. And I'm so glad to see that she is still committed to improving the lives of animals and people at home and internationally. So I'm glad to see that she wrote this letter. She is so involved with this organization. I remember her when she went on her visit there um, the first time and it was so cool. One thing I've got to say I do miss about um, them before was that they got to go on all these outings and we got to see them. But it's great to see that even now virtually and you know even if they're now based in the United States that she is still so committed with Prince Harry to these patronages and I'm so glad to see that they're still getting her support and they feel her support as well. You can sense the excitement as they updated the people on their social media about this. And I'm sure that Megan is so grateful for all who have put in their support towards this organization and improving the lives of animals and people in communities at home in London and internationally, according to Mayhew's website. So this is an update for you. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below. And for those of you who are, you know, pet owners, let me know what your pets have meant to you during this time. I would like to know that in the comment section below. And as I'm reading the story, I I'm always remembering the rescue chickens that Harry and Meghan have as well. So I think that's very sweet. So once again, share your thoughts with me below. And 
before I sign off, this is the comment of the day, courtesy of my Patreon supporter Joyce. Though you here on YouTube, you do go by the name Kenneth under that handle as well. I'm sure it's a shared account. Thank you, Joyce, for your support. And this is your comment on Harry and Meghan's little addition, their sweet baby girl, Lily Bet Lily Diana. And you said that this is such good news. I'm so happy for Harry and Meghan. And you also said that you loved the name. You expected it. Oh, I would like to hear much more about that, Joyce. So thank you so much for your support. And that is the comment of the day. For those of you who'd like your comment to be featured, be sure to check me out on Patreon and PayPal. And who knows, you could become the comment of the day. And as many of you know, I have launched my YouTube membership. For those of you who'd like to become members of the channel and support the channel financially, there is an option for you to do so right here on YouTube. Just click join and you can become a member and there will be cool perks for you. I'm looking forward to seeing you there. So once again... I'm happy to share this update and once again, I'm so happy for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex on the birth of their sweet baby girl. Cannot wait for them to share some images of her and I'm so looking forward to covering that. So once again, let me know your thoughts about the main story today about Mayhew and the Duchess of Sussex's Ford in the comment section. Happy to see her still going strong on her support for her, her patronages. It shows her heart, her heart of compassion and of community that is right at the heart of Megan. So happy to share this with you. I love you all. Have a great day. Thank you for those who like, comment, share. Thank you to all of my Patreon, PayPal and membership supporters for this channel. I love you all. Once again, thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Have a blessed one.